just here this afternoon because I wanted to make another video for you. And this video is going to be about metrics. And the metrics that we're going to be looking at is going to be R squared, which is the coefficient of determination. And R squared indicates the proportion of variance explained by the model. It is useful for regression analysis. The value of R squared ranges from 0 to 1, which is expressed as a percentile. So what we want to do is we want to do an example of R squared. So what we have is we have a data set here with our studied is our independent or our X variable. And uh, the exam score is our uh, dependent or our Y variable. And we're going to find out the R square of that by checking RSQ, in which B3 to B13 is the dependent score, Y variable, and A3 to A13 is the independent score, which is the X variable. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to move this over. And uh, basically, the score that you get is going to be anywhere from 0 to 1. So, and it's expressed in a percentile range. So, this R square is 0 0.97. So, that indicates it's 97%. So, since R squared use, is used in regression analysis, we're actually going to create a regression analysis of this data set so you can see it. So, what we do is we block off. what we want to analyze and we go to insert we go to recommended charts go to scatter plot and we pick this one Okay, so after we've done our scatter plot, we come over here to plus, we go to trend line, we, so we go to the trend line, we click on to more options. And so in more options, we're going to go linear, which you can also, because that's what it is, it's linear, but you can also go exponential. It looks like it'll look a little bit better with exponential, but we're going to keep it on linear for the time being. And um, it's just being a bit slow today. So we're going to come over here, we're going to say display equation on the chart and display R squared value on the chart. So we've got the equation and R squared value. I'm going to look at it for exponential. Maybe it'll work a little bit better with exponential. But it's, and, and there you go. There we have it. We have a linear regression that we set to exponential. And we've got the... Um, equation on the chart and we've got the r squared on the chart but i think what i'm going to do is i'm going to take it back to linear and then so there's your linear regression line and it gives you your uh formula which is y equal 3.9368x plus 37.779 and um, R squared equals 0.9735. So that's your linear regression as well. So that's how you create your R squared in Excel. So you can see how we made it using the R squared formula. And we can also get it by making an XY scatter plot and turning on the equations and the formulas for that. So I'm going to go ahead and close this video because I've discussed what I wanted to discuss. And if you like my video, please like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching my video. 
and I look forward to making more videos for you about Excel and statistics in the future.